Hey everyone, um, as a caregiver, I often find myself in the car um, waiting through appointments um, because medical appointments are common. And so I bring a bag with me to have things to do on the fly and find nice places to park, hopefully, where I can be creative or relax or breathe. And right now I'm thinking about the challenge and um, a little bit of the challenges I've had because I had a prescription mix up um, with, with the pharmacy and um, it was delayed a day and um, I had no idea what a big deal what that was. So boy, it really threw me for a loop physically and mentally and emotionally. It was just weird. Um, so that was, that was unexpected. Um, <laughs> So I, I found some tools to get through it. I've been working every day to find them um, and just keep on uh, with anything, really. Um, so yesterday I got out the DSLR camera, mine that has not been easy to grab for. So I'm really thinking about my space that I work in and making sure that things are ready to go. Um, it's been so long since um, I've sewn regularly because I loved it so much and I ended up just, you know, kind of shutting down in that area with some other things that were going on um, and the um, extreme health concerns I had to uh, manage for a while um, as a caregiver. And so, um, anyway, coming back is awesome. It's challenging to work through um, all the blocks, but um, totally worth it. So, you know, I used costume. Um, I I drafted costumes or I drafted clothing based on what I saw. Um, I was never formally taught. Um, sometimes my mom jumped in and helped with some finishing stuff if I was on a deadline. Um, so yeah, so I did like 1800s, I did 1700s, I did bizarre costumes for my kids or extravagant things where I did, I costumed a theater production. Um, and then I've done a bunch of wardrobe stuff and my brain is always designing for people. So that's why I'm here because I kind of sorted it out and realized I really love this still. Um, and I'm trying to excavate all of that um, past a lot of traumatic things that have happened between there so um, navigating PTSD or CPTSD and um, kind of excavating back to something that really matters to me has been my journey so we'll see how this goes